right, I get to call this next game, and it is for Kathy and Colin, and this game involves you people a lot, so I need your help in this game. While they're doing a scene, I'm going to occasionally stop the scene, yell freeze, and I'm going to come to you people for different styles, different genres, maybe of a film or theater or television or music or, or whatever I want. They're going to have to continue the same scene in these different styles. So be thinking of styles that maybe we don't get all the time. So to start them off, let's see. Uh, uh, you, miss, in the, uh, in the sparkle number. You. What's your name? Marnie. Marnie. Marnie, where are you from? New York. And what do you do there? You do nothing? <laughs> And you live in North Carolina? That's a strange thing to do in New York. <laughs> All right. I'm going to give you guys that. The strange life of a woman named Marnie who lives in New York, except is usually in North Carolina. Options. Did you feel that earthquake? I'm not doing anything. <laughs> Honey, I wasn't blaming you for the earthquake. I just said, did you feel the earthquake? I'm just not doing anything, and I am so bored here in bored? North Carolina. Bored? Look out the window. We're now in New York. Oh. Oh. <laughs> North Carolina has moved to New York because of the plates of the earth. They shifted. Yes. Freeze. A style of film. Western. I heard Western first. Continue as a Western. Well, let me just sashay over to the window here and see what the hell's out there. Well, oh my goodness gracious, it looks like there's going to be a shootout at the OK Corral. Get your gun, honey. Well, I... <laughs> <laughs> warning! A little more warning! Uh, I'm sorry, I just haven't done anything for so long that I just didn't know what to do, but Freeze. I... Freeze! Uh, theater! Ford's theater? Not, 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 a, not a specific theater. <laughs> All right, this continuing Ford's theater, uh, let's see a little, uh, our American cousin, maybe a president will get assassinated. It's gonna be very awesome. Thank you, sir, for your incredible specificity. Ford's bloody theater. Good, sir. Look up in the box. It's President Abraham Lincoln. Oh, <laughs> come on! Freeze, freeze, freeze. Now, we'll try this again. Can I get a genre that might take place in a theater? Huh? Shakespeare, thank you, miss. Shakespeare. Anon, good nurse. Yes, my mistress. I, I have but nothing to do today. I would like to go anon to the village square and look for young men by pushing my bosom up high in my dress. I, I did well, same as you when I was young. I have pushed my bosom well beyond my chest, and now it does lay my by bottom. <laughs> I do, but Have I not noticed I am bleeding from the head and arm? Oh, good nurse, I just thought it was but a natural state of thy life as my servant. Oh, Juliet, you are so young and know not much of the world. The blood is leaving my body like a man who does not want to pay his bar check. Good nurse, I'm so tired of living here in North Carolina and then New York and then North Carolina and New York. I want to me to come a boyfriend. Freeze. Uh, let's see, uh, you, sir, where were your grandparents born? Right, where, where, where are they from? Mexico, continue in Mexico. Hola! <laughs> I cannot help but see that you had the gunshot wound in the shoulder. Mexico. 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 All right, I got shot right in the arm, right there. Did you see that? Like a bullet came right at the. Like, Let me move the piñata! You know, I've only been in Mexico for three minutes, and uh, oh, I think oh, I might settle down. Freeze, freeze, freeze. I'd like to apologize to your grandparents. Uh, let's see, uh, you miss a number between one and five. Three, and a number sir, between one and 20. 17, three and 17. Kathy, you may only speak in sentences containing three words and three words alone. Colin, 17 words. <laughs> and I'd like to continue in that bizarre part of Mexico that you guys were both from. Hola, senior gunshot. Oh, I know you want a boyfriend, and I'll do what I can for you if you actually want one, yeah? <laughs> Oh, I know men 
many a man who'd like to marry you because you are the most beautiful woman in this side of Mexico. I oh, I. Love your accent. Oh, it's just a little thing I picked up when I was born in Scotland and move over here to Mexico just I fucking learn stuff. All right, let's hear it for him, Colin and Kevin. <laughs>